What is going on, NCK? Deathstar813 here, and welcome back to another Battlefield Hardline video. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day so far. I know I am. It's finally May, not April anymore, which was an awful month for me, but we're not going to talk about that this video. We're going to talk about the stealth outfits for each character for the mechanic class. We're going to start out with the Thieves here, and obviously with the Thieves, you can tell that he has a, I'm just going to call it maroon, it's definitely not bright res, I'm just going to say maroon, uh, vest. He has a dark, not dark, but a brown mask and his pants are a uh, tint of maroon we go on to stealth here and i don't know if the pants change i think they do i think they go more black uh but then obviously you have the mask which is now gray and the leather vest which is now also gray as opposed to regular maroon it is worth noting that each of these stealth outfits do cost one hundred thousand dollars of in-game money and you have to buy for each character meaning that you have to buy for all the Bangers, the Thieves, the Undercover, and the SWAT. Sorry, I have to think about that. So that turns out to $400,000 for each outfit. Not each, for all outfits as a collective. And I would just like to, to uh, obviously here before I say that, obviously you have the gray vest, the white hat, and the black face mask thingy, the uh, bandana thingy mahua. But I would just like to say a quick, huge thank you. Uh, I just blew into your guys' microphone. I would just like to say a quick, huge thank you to you guys for that amazingly awesome uh, response to the Elite video. Again, if you want to see that, it's down in the description. I showcase all of the Elite outfits for the mechanic, char uh, mechanic characters again. And the Elite outfits do cost $250,000, so that's a million, as opposed to the 400000 that you would need. And it's, it's expensive but worth it because they do look really cool, except for some of them, which kind of look pointless. Now here with the SWAT, you have obviously the camoed hat and the camoed vest and all the gear are also camoed. Here with the undercover, you have the regular blue hat, blue t uh, not t-shirt, but the blue shirt and the black vest, all pretty dark colors. It's kind of amazing that they were able to actually think that they could get away with doing a stealth thing and no, thinking that no one would really be upset. I mean, personally, I think it's pointless to have this for someone who's already in dark clothing, but, you know, I mean, as you can see, everything's darker, and it's the same camo on his vest as the SWAT. I'm not saying anything bad about it, it's just, it seems really pointless to me, but that's me personally. I'm here to showcase this to you guys, not to use myself. I'm going to keep with the elite outfits, because I like those personally. My personal favorite is the Thieves here, and just because I like the, uh, the look of the leather vest, how that goes from maroon to black, I don't know, it just seems more... Almost professional, I suppose. But that's about it, guys. Uh, again, there's a link in the description down below. I'm just going to keep spinning this guy around. Uh, there is a link in the description down below to all the elite outfits and what they look like. And also to a playlist once I get that created of all the video showcasing the outfits. Right, about, right now, it's just the stealth and the elite. I will be doing a Team Pride outfit showcase for all the characters of the mechanic class. That'll be down the road, though. I don't have much time to do this stuff. Uh, obviously, if you look back at the dates of my videos, April was kind of a no-show for me, unfortunately. But, hey, you know, it happens. But now I have more time, so I'll, hopefully I'll be out quicker than the gap between these two videos. And that's about it, guys. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure to hit that like button if this helped you at all, or if you just liked it in general, I suppose. I don't know why. But if you liked it in general, just hit that like button. It really shows your support and uh, makes me motivated. To make more videos like this. I will be doing tips and tricks videos. Along with like I said. The showcasing of the Team Pride outfits. For the mechanic class. Along with more once I get those outfits unlocked. For the other three classes. So if you like to see those. And not miss out on them. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. And also be part of the NCK. Best family, best group, best crew on YouTube. Uh, we don't care about haters and trolls. But we do care about each other. And those who deserve to be cared about. That's why the non-caring crew. No cares is given to the idiots of the internet 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 and uh yeah again make sure to hit the subscribe button to never miss a video make sure to hit that like button if you liked it and it helped you at all and or helped you at all and that's about it guys thank you so much for watching long live the nck take care and have a wonderful day goodbye thank you for watching and i'll talk to you guys later goodbye